place I like to go in the country, don't you know? There's gonna be a lot of things to see down on the farm. First there'll be a cow, and of course there'll be a horse, and not to gloat, but there'll be a goat down on the farm. Brown Swiss cow, de lop de lop bo, with a honk a honk here and a honk a honk there. Good morning, Woodhead. Good morning, Farmer Gov. I'm just getting us a little milk for breakfast. <laughs> no, thank you. I've already had my breakfast three hours ago. Say, did you see my new scooter? It's pretty fast. I'm sure it is. Probably faster than the mail. Really? Wow. Woodhead, do you know what today is? Monday. Not the day of the week. It's a special day. Saturday. Vermont Family Farm Day. I knew that. And you know who's coming here today? Um, a family? U.S. Senator Patrick Leahy is coming here today. The senator is coming here? Yes, <laughs> oh, no. to present an award to the Vermont Family Farm of the Year. He's coming here? At 5 o'clock. <laughs> the senator and the TV reporters are coming right here. Television! <laughs> Television, here we gotta go! We have to have the farm looking better than ever before, which means we haven't got much time. The senator's <laughs> coming, and we're going to be on TV. <laughs> what the heck? What the heck? Calm down. I've arranged for a whole busload of college students from Middlebury to help us out. How about the farm kids? They'd help. No, they're just kids. They're too young. No. Here, put the sign up in front of the entrance okay. so the bus driver will find us. Gotcha. I'll be back faster than you can say. Peter Piker pot of pit of pickers. <laughs> I mean, Patty Piker. We haven't pot of got butter. all day. Move it. Okay. Oh, no, I've got two jobs farm chores and woodhead. Are you sure you put the sign up okay? Yeah. It's easy to get lost around here. Mm -mm, I've never been lost. Move it, the farmer's coming. Woodhead. Here's a list of things for you to do. Mm -hmm. You think you can handle it? I can handle anything. I was afraid of that. Now, here, after you feed the goats. Oh, yep, go. Okay. You put the pigs in the outside pen. That's not a pig, it's a cow. I know. And I'll get you to mow the big field. Yes! But wait till I'm around before you get on that big tractor. No! All right, you can put on the cutter. Box. Yes! And put some gas in it. No, I put gas in it yesterday and you hardly drove it. Woodhead, don't argue with me. Oh, Just spell it up. I don't, we've got to... <laughs> Good morning, Dudley. Did you see my new scooter? Farmer Guff says it's faster than a mail truck. The senator's coming today with a whole bunch of TV reporters and things. We gotta be ready. Someday I'm gonna be a real farmer. Maybe I'll win an award. Oh! 
someone I admire Whether you're feeling up or down It's good to have a friend around So let's be friends Well there's one thing that I desire Is to have a friend, someone I admire tractor doesn't need gas, it's practically full. And he wants me to ride the little tractor, because I'm not big enough for the big tractor. I'm not going to drive it, I'm just going to get on it. I'm not going to drive it, I'm just going to start it up. I know this is difficult for your woodhead, but any more shenanigans behind my back, and I'm gonna have to let you go. Is that clear? Oh, yes, sir, I see your point. I wonder what happened to those college volunteers. Excuse me. You wouldn't happen to know where the senator's coming, would ya? No. Nope. Well, do you know where the farm barn is? No. Nope. Well, do you know where Shelburne Farms is? No. Nope. Well, you don't know much, do ya? No. Nope. <laughs> Chicken pen, old fat hen laying eggs again. Sometimes nine and sometimes ten. Old fat hen's been busy again. A little red rooster going cock a doo doo. A little red rooster's in the chicken yard too. He's walking round, he's strutting his stuff. A little red rooster, he's falling in love and loves just to twinkle. Kicking up dust in my chicken pen. Oh, fat hen in my 
chicken pen The old fat hen laying eggs again Sometimes nine and sometimes ten The old fat hen's been busy again A little bit of chickens going pee 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 A little bit of chickens I can get no sleep There ain't no denying these chicks are multiplying Oh, fat hen, she's done it again. Woodhead, this place is a mess. Where'd you put the rake? Oh. Oh. I want you to put the rake on. Farmer Gov, you have egg on your face. Hey, Waldo. Guess who's coming to Shelburne Farms? You'll never guess. How'd you guess? I'll call you back. Who is it? Who is it? Oh, God. It's Woodhead. Would you like sugar in your tea? I don't want any tea! I'll be right back. Waldo, it's me again. Yep. If you pick the senator up in your limousine, and you take him to the farm barn, you'll see the sign. Can't miss it. Oh, go away, Woodhead. It's tea time. I don't want any tea, Woodhead. What? Would you put that tray on the table there? Oh, ow! Oh, How's my patient? Oh, I'm not a patient, Woodhead. Don't you ever listen. I hear a tractor. I hear the big tractor. I hear the big tractor. There's no one on the tractor. No one's on the tractor. Oh, you're too okay. Ow, 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 ow. Let me get these boots off. What head? What? What? Did what happen? You get off my feet. You'll sleep better. What my feet? You'll sleep what better. Head? Sleep. What head? What head? Get. I don't believe it. I don't believe it. <laughs> oh, 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 oh. What head? Get off of me. Get. Let's go uh, back to phase uh, one. Tea uh, is I don't want a tea. I don't want to die. Hey, nice scooter. Yeah, it's probably faster than a mail truck. Boy, some kind of mess around here. Looks like a twister came through. What's the matter with you? Looks like you lost your best friend. Yeah, I screwed everything up. By the way, the sign out front is pointing in the wrong direction. I would have missed the turn if I didn't know better. What? <laughs> Nothing much. Except I got the sign backwards. I don't think the volunteers are coming. And I practically destroyed the whole farm. And I think I lost the best friend I ever had. But other than that, I feel pretty good. No luck fishing, huh? What are you using for bait? Artificial flies. You'll never catch anything with those. I got just what you need. I have wonder worms. Best worms in the world, raised right here on Shelburne Farms. Really big fish, huh? 
guaranteed you'll have a hard time carrying them. Thanks. They're a little squashed. Well, they're flatworms. Well, we gotta go. Come on, guys. Are you in trouble? Maybe we should help them. Hey, Woodhead, we'll give you a hand. You will? <laughs> You'll help me? And then we're going fishing, because we've got wonder worms. You got wonder worms. Yes! Okay, listen up, everybody. The senator's going to be here soon, and I need your help. We got to get the place ready. Are you with me? I said, are you with me? I can't hear you. Are you with me? <laughs> Yo, let's go. Well, if you've got the chance to help someone who's feeling blue, who will lend a helping hand. I'm sure they do the same for you. Working together always works better. That's what we must do. Call it teamwork. Teamwork makes the dream work. If you take the time to help someone who's feeling down, well, they would do the same for you if things got turned around. What goes around comes around. That's what we have found. Call it The dream world. Okay, we're gonna begin our offensive with Dudley doing a down and out deep Hail Mary double reverse. We gotta get these sheep back in the pen. Now, Lucy and Amber, let's give Dudley some blocking. Clover, pump it up, girl. I need two gallons minimum. Now, you piggies, let's bring home the bacon. <laughs> Sorry. And chickens, let's lay some eggs. Rooster. <laughs> You know what to do. It's time to put it in the end zone. Let's go! Well, if you've got the chance to help someone who's feeling low, open up your heart and try to let your feelings show. For working together always works better. That much we all know. Call it teamwork. Teamwork makes the dream work. Teamwork. Teamwork makes the dream work. Things just seem to work out better when we work together. Teamwork. Teamwork makes the dream work. Teamwork. Teamwork makes the dream work. You guys look bushed. I can get the rest. Thanks for your help, though. Farmer Guff's gonna be really surprised. Thanks for the worms. You mean thanks for the giant fish? Yeah. Best worms in the world, you'll see. Good afternoon, Farmer Goth. Woody? I'm just finishing up here, and then I'll be out of your way forever. No, 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 wait a second, Woody. What happened here? The farm looks great. It, it's almost ready. You must have had a lot of help. Did those college kids come after all? Not exactly. I had a little help from the farm kids and the animals. Farmer Guff, I'm really sorry about spilling the hot tea, and I don't know if the volunteers are gonna show up because I put the sign backwards. You put the sign backwards? Well, how did you do that? Oh, I don't know. First, I started with the arrow. Uh, never mind. You more than made up for it. 
The senator will be here soon. Yeah, and he's going to be arriving in a stylish, shiny white limousine. The senator never drives in a limo. <laughs> He'll probably come in his own car. <laughs> That's what you think. <laughs> Those farm kids are great. I think we have time to get everything done. But you better keep going with the milking. Yeah. Well, we got to mow the field, but it'll go a lot faster if I use the big tractor. I'll go get it. No, 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 Farmer Guff, please, please, please. I've watched you a hundred times. Please, I can do it. All right, but before we do that, let's concentrate on this area first, where the people are going to come and all the TV cameras. Okay, I'll okay. go get it. What? I think Wood has lost his mind. They don't seem to miss it. Me. You wouldn't happen to know where the senator's coming, would you? No. Woodhead. I gotta get the tractor. The tractor? I must say, Farmer Guff, this is quite an impressive operation you have here. I have run just like... <laughs> Clockwork. On behalf of all Vermonters, we're here today to honor the hard work and dedication of the Vermont farmer. And to recognize this year's Vermont Family Farmer of the Year, Roger Rainville of Alberg. Time after time, day after day, from sunup to sundown, the resourceful farmer in a beautifully crafted execution of ingenuity and hard work shows his dominion over animals and machines. Let's not forget the image of the humble, solitary farmer, alone on the tractor, who puts the food on our table and makes our lives less worrisome.
I will never turn my back on the family farmer. It always impresses me how the farmer's wisdom and work ethic and sheer determination keep life on the farm so manageable. Every day, like clockwork, the Vermont farmer brings home the bacon. It's comforting to know we're in good hands with a family farmer behind the wheel. Vermont needs a family farm, and America needs a Vermont family farm. So let us give thanks to all the hard-working and dedicated farmers of Vermont and across the country. The American farmer is indeed a hero. Thank you, thank you, thank you. That's enough. Oh, that's enough. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Good evening. From farmhand to national hero, Vermont's own Woody Woodhead isn't forgetting his roots. Woodhead today received the nation's highest award for bravery. He saved U.S. Senator Patrick Leahy from sure death. As most of you know, it was two weeks ago at Shelburne Farms when a runaway tractor was barreling down, heading straight for the senator's podium. With no regard for his personal safety, Woodhead jumped aboard, bringing the machine under control just in time to avert disaster. Woodhead picked up his award today, saying he accepts it on behalf of the real heroes of this country, the American farmers. You see, Dudley? Dreams can come true. Slide trombone. The farmer got his fiddle cause he wanted to. 